Welcome back. We're going to talk about Greek yogurt. It, of course, is a great substitute for many things. How about sour cream or mayonnaise? And today we're taking it a step further with healthier alternatives to traditional desserts. So a lot of folks know that you can use Greek yogurt for those things, but we're actually going to make some sweet things. Melissa Bradley is here. She's a registered dietitian at hy V in Savage. It's good to have you back. Thanks for having me back out. So, yeah. I this mean, is really versatile. I it's mean, so versatile, and it's summertime, so I wanted to bring something sweet, maybe a little frozen treat, because it's been so hot lately. Everybody's yes. trying to cool down. But So we've substituted, we're going to be making a frozen yogurt bark today. So really similar to like the almond barks or the white chocolate barks that you might make around the holidays, but this one is perfect for summertime. Okay. So all you do is you take a 32 ounce container of vanilla Greek yogurt and we're going to add in just a quarter cup of honey. Okay, so vanilla, so it, is, it has vanilla it in it. It has vanilla okay. in it. So you could use plain and add your own vanilla extract if you wanted to, okay. but that vanilla is really going to bring kind of that nice little bit of a sweeter flavor for that. Okay. And then once you get that all stirred together, it's right. so simple. This is where the kids can get involved. You can have them spread it out on a flat baking sheet for you. Um, and really, then they can add whatever toppings they like. So today I've picked oh, so some really bright colorfuls. Yep, just okay. spread it right on there. And I've added some, some bright colors today. So we did kiwi, um, because one medium kiwi has about 60% of your daily vitamin C needs. So it's a really nutrient packed fruit that I think a lot of people kind of take a step back from and maybe forget about because of that fuzzy outside skin. Yeah, I know, but it is, <laughs> it is great once you get it opened up, that's for sure, and it's starting to, uh, um, you know, come into season in certain parts of the country. It so is, it is, going and the skin sale. is edible. So if you're feeling like Seriously? you want to try it, yep, the skin is completely I edible. So if you can that. get past the fuzz, you might really enjoy that. Okay, so and then we've also picked, yep, just spread that out flat, and then we've added some blueberries, and I've also brought in some mango today. Um, and mango, again, is packed with fiber, over 20 vitamins and minerals, so again, a really good option. And then we've chosen some almond granola and then a little bit of toasted coconut that we could put on top. So we can pick some of our favorite toppings to assemble here. So I'm okay. going to add some kiwi good. on there. All right, awesome. I'll do some blueberries. Perfect. Yep, and Greek yogurt, we really love not only because it's filled with protein, but because it also has something called probiotics in it, which are really important for our gut health or our gut microbiome. And there's been so much research showcasing how important it is to have a healthy gut microbiome as far as for weight maintenance and even for our immune system and our digestive health. So yep, absolutely. It is, it is so important. There's so many different things about it that uh, matter. And so if you're not going to take a supplement, why not just add it to your food, Add right? it to your food. Yep. Yes, exactly. So find a place where you can incorporate it into your diet. So all we would do with this then is just stick it in the freezer at okay. least for an hour. But I froze it overnight, and I feel like it turned out fabulous. And then oh. there is some of the final product. Just like that, huh? Yes. So just leave it in the freezer, and then you can grab leave it out. Leave it in the freezer. I just separated it with some wax paper in between, and you can just store it in the freezer. And then here we also have the cookie dough, which I have added Greek yogurt instead of eggs, so it's completely edible. Um, and so that's kind of been a fun little surprise so to have no in eggs, the stores. No yogurt. eggs. It's Greek yogurt, almond butter, chocolate chips, vanilla extract. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I have some for you guys. Do you guys want to try some? Knows. She knows. She looks <laughs> ready. That's really good. Well, thank you. Yes. Mm. I like that. Awesome. You gave us both How these recipes? Like yes, this? both of those should be available on care11.com. Oh, fabulous. Well, I love mm. it. These are good, good options well, all around. Is that good? Yeah. yeah. Well, good Try you. some you of the bark. Best. Okay. <laughs> Pick a piece with your well favorite. fed this morning. We've got the Kemp's ice cream and now they're all getting the frozen more, treats, right? Um, nice job. Very healthy thank options. You. Yes. You guys good? We're good. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank we you so appreciate it. There's uh, such great uh, uh, ideas, of course, at Hy-Vee. You can um, get these frozen yogurt bark recipes and a link to Hy-Vee on care11.com.